and then, uh oh. Okay, and share my screen. All right, well, I am so happy that you took the time out of your day to hop on this call tonight. I believe what we're going to share is incredibly valuable information, especially for us moms who just want to do what is what is best for our children. So we are, we're really excited to share this with you. Um, we really are going to talk about our kids' health as well as our own because it really, it, it, it all wraps up into one, right? A healthy mom, a healthy dad is a healthy child. Um, so we're going we're gonna to address all of that on tonight's call. And at the end, you're going to hear some amazing stories. So you're in for a real treat. I want you to know that myself, along with the person who invited you on this call, is a part of a really unique community called the Healthy Living Revolution. And we are a group of people that are coming alongside of individuals and families and helping them to take their health back in ways that are simple, doable, and fun. And so you're gonna hear about some simple changes that you can make tonight, um, and we're just excited to share the information with you. So there are some reasons that we're really passionate. And the first is that there are two really startling trends that are happening in our world today. The first trend is that environmental toxins are increasing. So whether this is the products that we're putting on our skin, the air that we're breathing, the water that we're drinking, the food that we're eating, the pharmaceuticals that we're taking, for us and for our children, our world is just much more toxic today than it has ever been. And at the same time, our food quality is decreasing. In this image, it mentions preservatives, flavor enhancers, synthetic vitamins, artificial colors. Many of these are present in the food that we're feeding our children. And you know, I love this image because this gentleman is shopping in the center aisles of the grocery store. And about six years ago, when I began my health journey, I learned that really a lot of those foods I was buying in those center aisles were no longer food, but they were food-like products. I switched from looking at the calories and fat to looking at the ingredients. So when it comes to the food that we're buying for our children, looking at the ingredients needs to be key, um, just to make sure that we're helping fuel their body to fight this increase in toxicity from our environment. This is a real photo of a, of a kindergarten lunch. And while there are lots of colors, um, they are not obviously the colors that we, that we maybe want to be getting into our children. And it's really interesting because this, this lunch specifically has 46 grams of sugar. Many people, I don't, I don't know if many moms know that a child should never have more than 25 grams of sugar a day. And this is what's really important. When you consume 10 teaspoons of sugar, you can reduce your immune fu function up to 50%. And this happens for five hours after eating that meal until our immune system is fully recovered. So 10 teaspoons of sugar, that's 40 grams of sugar. So that lunch would be enough for that child to have a reduced immune system for five, for five more hours. Um, I can I think about a lot of standard breakfasts that our kids eat with some of the yogurts and pouches that and pouches that we serve our kids and some of the crackers and um, pretzels and stuff that we're giving our kids. A lot of some of our breakfasts are more than the 25 grams that our kids should have throughout the whole entire day. So I had didn't know until I joined this community. I I learned through this community that sugar is such a huge factor in our immune function. And you consider when flu season starts, which is right around the same time that Halloween is. So here we are, you know, allowing our kids or letting our kids, which trust me, I know it's a battle, but consume quite a bit of sugar and they're leaving that with this reduced immune function. I think it's just a different way of looking at it. Um, it makes me a little bit more empowered to take control about what I'm feeding my kids. So this is Dr. David Katz. He's the head of prevention at Yale University. And he said this may be the first generation of children to have a shorter life expectancy than their parents. Since he said this quote, it's actually been proven true that if, if we do not make any changes, this will be the first generation of children to have a shorter life expectancy. And that's really concerning because in all of documented humankind, we have always lived longer. So for something to be going on today that is causing our children to live not as long as us, it, it is definitely concerning. I believe we're going to switch that statistic around because we're all here on the phone tonight. I think, you know, we're all passionate about our kids' health. That will never change. So I believe we're going to take the necessary changes that we need to, but I really think our diet is the first step that we can make. He also shared that by the age of 12, many of our children have developed the beginning stages of hardening of the arteries. One in three children is obese, and one in three will develop diabetes. 
More than 25% of our children take prescription drugs on a regular basis. And they are recommending children as young as eight can be treated with cholesterol lowering statin drugs. So whether we're talking about our kids or we're talking about ourselves, oxidative stress is linked to poor health in all individuals. So what is oxidative stress? Well, it really is the internal aging of our body, the, the aging of our cells, and um, it's happening to all of us. There's really nothing we can do about oxidative stress. As long as we're breathing, we have oxidative stress, so it's, it is good. Um, and the more that we breathe, the more active that we are, the higher our, our oxidative stress. So consider our children out there running around. Um, they have even more. You're, they could, you know, they're more active than we are. And our best defense against oxidation is antioxidants. So I want you to consider an apple. And when you cut open an apple, that flesh hits the, um, hits the air and it begins to oxidize. It begins to age, to brown, and to rust. But if you take a lemon, which is an antioxidant, and you take the lemon juice and squeeze it on the apple, you're delaying the browning, the aging, the rusting process. And the same thing happens for us when we consume antioxidants. They provide like a barrier around our cells to help keep us as healthy as possible. And we all know where we get antioxidants from. We get them from fruits and vegetables, not exactly from a vitamin. Um, but unfortunately, our mass-produced produce is packing a much less nutritional punch. And there's two main reasons for this. The first is soil depletion. I'm not going to talk about that tonight. But the second is that our food is mass-produced. So our, our fruits and vegetables are picked sometimes two to three weeks before we buy them in the store. And then they're meant to sit on our countertop for a week but most of the nutrition comes into our fruits and our vegetables within the last 24 to 48 hours of ripening on the vine. And our produce simply cannot ripen on the vine if we're gonna buy it from a grocery store because they have to pick it way too soon so that it's not rotted by the time we get it from the grocery store. So this image really kind of answers it all, right? This is the iron content that was present in a bowl of spinach in 1953. In 1997, you had to eat 43 bowls of spinach to get that same iron content, and that was 20 years ago. So I really believe this is why those statistics from Dr. David Katz are so scary, is because we are just up against a battle of our environment becoming so much more toxic and our food being so depleted. And our children, I think, are showing the effects the worst. So what do we do? A lot of people thought, we've thought for years, it started in the 1950s and 1960s, that we can bridge the gap with a vitamin. But we're learning that vitamins, of course, in the, in the past 15, 60 years, we've not gotten any healthier. They really are not the answer. Um, this is the label of what you could get in a multivitamin. And this is a label, I would say, of 400 ingredients that are present in an apple. But that is 400 of the now known 20,000 different ingredients that are present in one apple. And when we came up with the multivitamin, we didn't know. We didn't know that there was this, this many different ingredients in food. It is so powerful. And all of these ingredients are meant to work together synergistically in our body to either heal us or keep us well and do the same for our kids. Um, and they, they're in, in perfect ratio with each other. My favorite way to explain this is that lycopene is found in a tomato and it's known to fight prostate cancer but they're finding that when they remove the lycopene from the tomato, it has no effect on the cancer. And that's because that lycopene is working with the other thousands of ingredients that are present to, to fight that cancer. So we really need more whole food. We need seven to 13 is what they're saying, seven to 13 servings of fruits and vegetables a day, us and our children. And I kind of have to laugh saying that. Can you imagine trying to get seven to 13 servings, different fruits and vegetables into your child every day? I struggle to do that in, with myself. So the reason that we're all passionate is because at some point in our journey, we found an amazing solution called Juice Plus. Juice Plus has been on the market for 25 years. It was developed over 30 years ago by a doctor. His name is Dr. Smokey Santillo, and he was ahead of his time. He helped cancer patients juice, and his dad was diagnosed with lymphoma, and he was given three weeks to live. And he wanted to find a way to make his juice more powerful. So he decided that instead of juicing his fruits and vegetables, he was going to take the whole thing, the pits, the peel, the rind, the seeds, even the leaves, whenever possible, put it into a massive Vitamix and blend it up. 
And then he took what was left over and he dehydrated that at a cold temperature to preserve the nutrients. And it resulted in a powder. So I don't know if you can see in my camera, but this is a capsule full of powder. It's powdered produce. He took that powder and he pumped his dad full of it as much as he could get in him. And he ended up living for six more years. And not only did he live, but he thrived. And that's when he knew that he was onto something. He was onto the power of whole food. So now we have these three different blends. You see them here on, the, um, on your screen. We have our fruit blend, our vegetable blend, and our berry blend. And we all need this rainbow of colors. Us, our children, our husbands, our parents, every single day. Those different colors do different things in our body and, and support different systems in our body. Um, and imagine what this variety could do for your body, for your kid's body every single day. Whenever this product hit the market, some unique things started happening. People started having different experiences. And you're going to hear that in these stories um, later on in the call. But it was enough that it caused us to start researching our product. Okay, hold on, pause. I jumped ahead of myself. There are three things that make our product incredibly unique. And the first is, I just explained to you how it's made, is that it's food. This is a nutritional label on our capsules. Same with our chewables. We have, we have capsules and chewables so you can get it into your children easily. This is whole food in a capsule. When my son turned six months old, I started opening the capsule and putting it into his purees and feeding it to him. Now when my kids are like, for 15 months, they just chew up the capsule because it is just food. As long as they can have food, they can have juice plus. It's full of that phytonutrition instead of isolated vitamins, non-GMO, dairy-free, and gluten-free. We have an NSF certification, which is a third party that validates that what we say is in our product is and nothing more. That's really, really important, especially if you're going to feed this to your children. It's the highest level of certification you can receive. We've had it for over 20 years. And it's also what assures that it's free of any herbicides, pesticides, fungicides, mold, yeast, bacteria. So that's very important if you're going to give this to your children. And then finally, sorry, I jumped ahead of myself. We decided to take this product and put it in human beings with blood drawn and see what it was doing in the body. And we are now the most researched. We have 38 published studies with six underway. We are the most researched nutritional product in the world. We've been researched at places like MD Anderson, Yale, Wake Forest, Vanderbilt, Vanderbilt, some of the most prestigious facilities in the world. And I want to focus on a few of the studies that are just really important to our children. And the first is this study that supports our immune system. We actually have multiple studies that show that this product balances our immune system. And this is why, this is what's so important as you're getting ready to send your kids off to school, that you fuel them as well as you can. Um, our, you know, our product is known to balance the immune system, not boost the immune system, which is really important because right now we have an abundance of autoimmune diseases and that's a hyperactive immune system. So in your immune system, you have two kinds of, you have two kinds of cells, B cells and T cells. So I want you to imagine it's like a classroom and it has this perfect harmony to it. The T cells are the teachers, the B cells are the students. It's working in, in harmony. Things are, you know, the T cells tell the B cells what to do. Well, when you have, you know, an autoimmune disease or a weakened or out of balance immune system, it's like the teacher stepped out of the classroom and the kids are up on the, on the desk throwing spitballs everywhere. The B cells, the students are taking over. And what our product is proven to do is to come in and increase your number of teachers and decrease your number of students in a way that would get your immune system back into balance because it is just food and your body knows what to do with food. And that is so important. I just want to tell you a personal story. This past week, my kids, we were around, um, my cousins had hand, foot and mouth and we were around them and found out, you know, a few days later that they had that. And then we were also around, we were exposed to strep. And I had this, all of a sudden this feeling in me like, oh no, because I was that sick kid that if I was around anything, I was sick within 24 hours. I had a very, very weak immune system. And I was on antibiotics all the time. And I just had that tinge in me like, oh no, oh no, right? It's gonna happen, the fall is coming. Um, and it didn't, and it didn't because my kids have been fueled now for four years, ever since they've been six months old. I've been fueled now for four years. I'm no longer that person that the second I'm around it, I catch it. And that's the difference when you have a balanced immune system. The other thing I want to talk about is down here, the insulin resistance and abdominal fat mass. 
This was a study that was done at Nemours Children's Clinic, and it was published in the Journal of, the American, or the Journal of Pediatrics. It was done on overweight um, adolescents. It was boys aged six through 10. And they took our Juice Plus fruit and vegetable blends for six months, and they found that they were better able, they had better insulin resistance, and they had reduced their abdominal fat mass. And when one in three children are obese and one in three children will have diabetes, that's amazing. Like what would be the difference if we could get this product in more kids at a younger age? So then one thing I'm super excited to tell you about is our amazing program, which is now called Healthy Starts for Families, which is a program that allows children to get free Juice Plus. So as long as an adult is taking Juice Plus, they can sponsor any child, age four through 18, or a full-time college undergrad, it doesn't have to be their own child, to get free Juice Plus for up to four years. As long as the adult is taking it, the child gets it for free. And that's because our company has a heart to really change that stat that Dr. David Katz mentioned earlier. So this is what they're finding. 56% are taking less medication, 60% are missing less days of school, 61% are eating more fruits and vegetables, 66 are visiting the doctor less, 96% are reaping a positive benefit of some kind, which is amazing. So you'll hear some of those personal stories later. I want to mention our Juice Plus Complete Shakes to you because I have a four and a two-year-old myself, and I know how hard it is to feed kids. And the more and more I've learned about food, it's a real passion of mine. There was a time in my life where I thought there's nothing I can do. There's not, everything I'm going to eat is going to be bad. Um, and so this is my easy meal of the day. I have one every day. My husband, my kids have one every single day. They love it. They come in chocolate and vanilla. Um, it's plant-based. It has 24 different plants in them. They're delicious. They're low glycemic, so they stabilize your blood sugar, which is what allows you to actually stay full when you eat them. Vegan and non-GMO, gluten and dairy-free, full of plant-based protein. But what's really cool is this powerful prebiotic fiber that they're full of. I know of a lot of kids that aren't going to the bathroom regularly, and these things will fix that very quickly, along with our capsules and chewables. Um, and so I love this because it's it's the easiest and cheapest fast food that I know of. This is the fast food that I give my kids and I don't have to feel guilt afterwards. So in closing this part of the presentation, this is a quote from Dr. Richard Du Bois. He was the head of infectious disease in Atlanta, Georgia, and he's been named America's top doctor multiple times. He was the first of now, one of the first of now thousands of healthcare professionals to come alongside of our company and recommend this product to their patients. And he said, there is nothing available anywhere else in the world with or without a prescription that has been clinically proven to do what Juice Plus does. And I just think that he, he basically sums it all up there. And so it's what gives me such peace of mind that I'm able to share this amazing product with, uh, with my, in my own body and with my kids every single day. So at this point, I'm going to ask my amazing friend, Julie, if she can to unmute herself and just share with us why she decided to add Juice Plus. Um, Julie is a mom of eight, um, and so I just would love for her to share her story with everybody. Thank you so much. And believe it or not, we all take Juice Plus. We go through one bottle in 10 days, so it's a, but it's an investment that we're willing to make. So, But I didn't uh, start that way. So um, I met Julie a couple years ago, and we started walking. We live in the same neighborhood. And we, she told me about Juice Plus, and I have a, just a passion for nutrition and have been researching since I became a mother. Um, that's really where my passion for nutrition came. And I'm sure a lot of you, if you're a mom on this call, which you probably are, because this is what it's focused on, you know that when you have a child, all of a sudden, it just, it matters more. Um, that's probably why we're all here, because it matters more what we're feeding our children. It mattered more to me when I was pregnant, when I was putting in my own body. And so when Julie told me about Juice Plus, I had never heard of it, which I still find amazing because the company's been around for 25 years, but we are only in 2% of homes. And so I figured I didn't need to know much more, but at the same time, I was dealing with a new health-related challenge. My six-year-old, well, actually six now, so he was four, four-year-old son was dealing with asthma, and we had never come up against that. And as I found out, asthma is actually an autoimmune that Julie talked about there, where your immune system is just out of whack and it's going haywire. So something really small, like a change in season for him or a cold would trigger this asthmatic response, which would end him up in the pediatric intensive care unit. So these weren't small, these were big. And Julie keeps telling me about Juice Plus and how she can't promise anything, of course, 
but she's seen all these wonderful success stories. So I'm, I, I had a choice either to go on daily inhalers with him or to take daily vegetables and fruits with him. And so the rebel that I am decided we'll go with the fruits and vegetables. And so we did. And 16 months later, we have not seen the inside of a PICU. And we mostly manage his um, asthma. If he kind of goes to that place, it's never full blown, but if it gets kind of tight there, we usually manage it just with essential oils, which is incredible. Um, after he was taking it, we decided really, as I, re I researched myself and found out what Julie said, this is the most researched nutritional product in the world. The deeper I've looked into it, the more convinced I am that every single person needs it, uh, which is why I'm here sharing about it. Um, but we put everybody on it. And just for me personally, I was on it. And for the first time in my life, I'm not anemic. I've taken iron supplements. I've tried other, um, taking desiccated liver and nothing worked except juice plus from all those leafy green vegetables. Um, and then I have a daughter who struggled with eczema on and off her little, her whole life on her belly. And that is completely gone um, after being on juice plus. So I'm super excited to be able to share that with you tonight and really believe every single person should be looking seriously at this product. It's awesome. That's amazing, Julie. Thank you so much for sharing your story. And I agree with you. I love to say, I just think every mom needs to know it's an option, right? They put fruits, they put broccoli and kale into a capsule or chewable and every mom needs to know that that's an option. So at this point, Sarah, if you can jump on and share your story, Sarah is amazing. She's a nurse. She's a mom of two. She's a smart, smart woman. And she has an amazing story of what happened um, with her daughter. So we'd love to hear from you, Sarah. Can you guys hear me okay? I had to go in the basement because everyone's asleep and I get a little excited when I talk about this. So um, my story started in, well, it's been going on for a long time. My story with Juice Plus started very end of February, or early March. Um, the main reason I got started on this is my friend Amy, who's also an RN, kept telling me, Sarah, you need to look into this, Sarah, you need to look into it, because both my kids had some issues. One of the issues is, neither one of them could poop on a regular basis. I mean, poop was a problem in our household. And we ate fairly decently, but still every third day, it was just, it was a nightmare. So I was, I started it on for my son only because he would get it for free. And because Amy kept saying, you need to try this. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna try it, so leave me alone. So I got him on it and immediately he started pooping. So I'm like, okay, something's working. And I got it for myself and some energy was starting to sh creep up. And because my daughter was constipated too, um, I started her on it. And then the story with my daughter is what I'm gonna talk about. So from prob probably when she was 11 months old, she, um, nine months old, she got RSV. Two months later, she got two other viruses. that are a lot worse than RSV. Um, that landed her in the pediatric ICU on oxygen for four to five days. Um, because of those three viruses hitting her within such a short time frame, she scarred all of her lung tissue up and had reactive airway disease. Following that, um, last winter we had five bouts of pneumonia and she was on a doubled up maintenance inhaler that we took in the morning and in the, after and in the evening. We took albuterol, we took atrovent, we took oral steroids. And we took antibiotics all the time. We did ear tubes. We took out her adenoids, which I'm kicking myself for because that's an immune fighting function organ. And nothing worked. And I was just like, okay, her pronoun just said she'll probably grow out of it. It's going to take a couple of years. A couple of years on oral steroids is horrible for your brain. Let me just tell you. So I was just, I started cutting out dairy. We saw a little improvement, still sick still constipated all these meds also mess up everything else by the way your gut health is ruined on oral steroids so i had the gummies for ryan i started shoving them to liz i gave her half the dose of what ryan was taking and um i started her on him when she was in her fifth bout of pneumonia on every single medication i listed um within four weeks we were um just back to her maintenance inhaler. I looked up and it was due to refill all of her albuterol, her atrovent, and her backup oral steroids for her next dose of, 
her next round of zone yellow, which I was anticipating because every two to three weeks we were sick again. And I hadn't filled it and it hadn't been touched since the last bout when we started her on the gummies. So that got me thinking, okay, she's getting 20, between the fruit and veggie gummies, she's getting 20 fruits and vegetables. What is this micronutrition doing for her lungs? It's helping the cell renewal, it's helping her gut, her gut's feeding her whole body and her immune system is improving and her cell renewal is just going crazy. So we went to her pulmonologist appointment and in the back of my mind, I'm like, I wonder if we even need this maintenance inhaler anymore because she's not getting sick. She's getting runny noses, which would trigger her to go into pneumonia, allergies, anything. But she gets out of it in like three days, the runny nose is gone. So we went to her pulmonologist appointment. Mind you, we started her on the gummies in March, mid-March. Pulmonologist appointment was mid-May. She goes, what have you done? Why is she not sick? Her normal SATs when she's healthy is 93 to 94%. She was setting 98%. I had a pulse ox at home. I haven't used it in six months now. She goes, just take her off the maintenance inhaler. We'll see what she does. We've used albuterol for a half a day in mid-June or July, I don't even remember. We haven't used anything else yet. It's all packed up. I'm gonna have to figure out what to do with it. I don't think I can throw away. We're a bigger recycling family, but that's another story. So my son can poop, my daughter can breathe. I have a ton of energy. My husband's on everything now. He takes it, he's a computer software engineer and he gets brain fog all the time. And the omegas, he's like, I don't have to get up and walk around and get coffee anymore. So our whole family's on it. Our whole family will always be on it. And this winter, we're not going to get sick. <laughs> oh my gosh. You, I love your story and how you share it. My son can poop, my daughter can breathe, and I have energy. You just summed it up right there. I love it. So uh, thank you so much. That story amazes me. Every time I hear it, I get pumped up. Um, and that's why I love doing what I do and getting to share this product with people. I, I want to really briefly just touch on my story because I think it's important how we feel and how the moms are feeling with health. And Sarah really did share that when I found the product, my firstborn was three months old. So it was really kind of about me at the time. And I was that person, like I shared with you, that was chronically sick. Um, we have another friend who she was like, my daughters always get sick, but then I always catch it too. So it's not only about our kids health, right? It's about our family health. And that was me. And so I got on Juice Plus because my mom suffers from an autoimmune disease and I wanted to do everything I could to prevent that down the road for me. And I had zero expectations. I just knew it made sense. And it really was when I learned I could put the capsule in my son's mouth at six months old. That's when I knew it was super unique. So I got started and about uh, six weeks in, I hadn't had my terrible allergies that would lead to a sinus infection and land me on antibiotic. And now I'm going on four years of not being on antibiotic. I found that I actually had energy. I used to think I was a really good sleeper, like at 1 p.m. when I leave work and go sleep in my car, but actually that's not normal. I was chronically fatigued. That was a problem. So it was really fun to actually have natural energy. My mood improved which I learned later is because 90% of our serotonin is made in our gut and I was feeding my gut well and my mood was, you know, feeling the difference. And then finally this community just taught me how to make some amazing changes, um, which have just helped me to be even healthier, my husband and my kids. So I'm so thankful that this came into my life and I'm so thankful that we are a part of getting to share it with you tonight. We really invite you to do one of three things. You know, one, if you're just seeing, man, Maybe my kid's diet needs a change. Maybe mine needs a change. Maybe I need to add more fruits and vegetables. Then you're just ready to make some personal changes. Great. We're ready to help you and just meet you where you're at. Um, but number two, maybe you're like, this juice plus stuff makes sense. I think I really want to add that. If so, please get with the person who invited you. Juice plus is the most affordable and simplest way that we know to get a massive amount of nutrition into busy families. Um, it's only around two to three dollars a day and kids can get it for free. So please follow up with the person who invited you. And then finally, if you heard this message tonight and you thought, I know of somebody who needs to hear this message, please tell the person who invited you. That really is our mission, is to inspire healthy living around the world, to get this message out to as many people as as possible. As Julie said, only 2% of people uh, receive Juice Plus. And I believe if we're going to change that statistic from Dr. David Katz, 
we need to start opening our mouths more to our friends and our family about a simple, simple solution. So if you, if that, if that strikes you in any way, please tell the person who invited you and this call is recorded. So you can share this with them very, very easily. So I'm going to go ahead and unmute you all and you can say good night and thank you so much Julie and Sarah for sharing your amazing and you all have a wonderful, wonderful evening.